20 is the Druitt 1759 Maiden, 2 miles 5 on the flat, Amman Handball, Josh of Sutherland, Kiko's Accord, Davy Lard, Confidant Hutsey, Alex Cherry, Devilish Game Darren Thompson, Jumping Bean Pontypool Wilson, News Diamond Craig Beckworth, Neve Campbell, Mark Cooper and Southern Comfort Four Rolls. Eight winners on this long distance of two miles five over the Queen Alexander Stakes trip at Ascot, a real pointed to that I suppose. Or maybe the Gold Cup on Breed Cadron later in the season. Well we're settling on down and well over a long, long way to go and leave Campbell. Well, I believe made the running last week when Dropping away into further towards the end for Matt Cooper. Leads by a couple of lengths from Confident Footsie in second, Alex Cherry. Then comes Neil's Diamond and Seven Comfort Kiko's Cord. Jumper Bean gone just past it on the inside. Armour and Handball and Devilish Game at the back mark. Uh, long way to go, settling on down them. Um, Cut the maidens to finish off at Newbury after that. The, the, the early races. We started off the day with the Darling, the Queen of Stakes. And we're going to finish with a couple of maidens. This one well over two miles five. And the leader is Neve Campbell. She's got about four to five clear now. Old Commandant Footsie in second. Three lengths back to the third, uh, Jumping Bean on the inside of Southern Comfort. Behind these comes Kiko's Accord, and the last gone third through on the inside. Then comes Neo's Diamond and Devilish Game and the Hammer and Handle. But Neve Campbell set the pace at 20 miles per hour, they passed that marker. So it's a steady pace, far out the final lengths, Gil Confident, Deep Footsie in second. We've got a little bit of push along there in second, and again, a couple of lengths down to Kiko's Accord, who's running well within himself. Jumping Bean tracks him on the outside, and then widest of all is the Joshua of Sutherland trained. Hammer and Hamble, who's just picking up a bit. You know, in fact, those line, in the line at the rear, you can't really see which is bad. It's just Jumping Bean, though, who was for four, but he's not just a bad marker. Really tightly bunched behind the leading couple, and New Campbell has come back to. Uh, Kovdan puts you, who's been again pushed along in second, only two ends between them. Uh, her the free then to the Hammer and Handful, and Kiko's, of course, still going well on the whales. Coming through with Seven Comfort, and then comes Devilish Game Neo's Diamond Jumping Bean is just about marked, but any of these eight winners can still win the ball. Well over a mile to one, a mile and a third on actually. And Eve Campbell leads by two to three lengths from Confident Dante in second. The foot, oh, sorry, Confident Footsy in second. Lincoln's Hammer and Handful. Uh, devilish Game 7, Comfort Kiko's Accord, Jumping Bean. News Diamond has dropped dressed to be the bat marker. Passing a mile on the head towards the seven, is that the swing left handed? A year at the long Newbury bend, they're swinging around. New Campbell leads third all by three lengths and from the improving devilish game has gone through into second. Lost a couple of down deep foots, he may run his race, he's dropping back through the field now, he's been pressed for third by Kiko's Accord and on the outside. Um, handful and in between the pair comes seven comfort and now inside the six they're going to start the swing left handed. When they get into the six they'll have about five rounds left to run devilish game leads by a length from Kiko course a in second, back in for his separate cover, Amber and Rambles come under pressure in fourth on the inside, jumping bean, knee was diamonds made ground, knee Campbell shot right down through the field is now back mark and passed by Covenant, he took foot to the front two, I've dropped right away now and inside the four of them, we get to the End of the race and established game being pressed by seven comfort Neil's diamond out wide in third. Then can Kiko's a cold jumping bean two lengths away. Hammer and Hammer looks to be in trouble now. Inside the final three fills all this 
extreme distance of two miles five seven cavalry pushed along just ahead of Ke devilish game on the far side is now down to four nearest time close up of kiko's accord and it's a two left cap to jump in being on their clear in towards the final four and a half they go on the far side trying to get four on the rails is devilish game but near seven cap it's not happening she's pushed out goes on by half a left and these two are now stretching away deep inside the final four and now seven cap finally gets on top and goes Goes on to win by a length from, from Devilish Game in second. Up towards the line, Tommy Cummings wins. Devilish Game in second. Neil is time for Kiko's. Jumping beat all the way back to the leader, Neil Campbell. So, good staying stable on the poor walls. We've had a few good stays in this time. It's got no with someone comfort. Devilish Game in second. Neil's Diamond was back in third. When we come for the card, fourth was Kiko's Accord and fifth jumping bean. I'll see you for the next one soon.